之后三十五分钟。一架美国航空七十七号嘅客机喺恐怖分子挟持之下撞向五角大楼，当时正值翻工时间，唔少人就目击住五角大楼嘅西翼喺瞬间变成废墟。I heard the plane, a plane, right over my left shoulder. Looked up and it was totally out of place, and I was a little confused at first. And I looked, and there was a plane coming over the hill right between the highway and the Navy annex. 翻工嘅人就喺大楼里面经历生死一刻。When it happened, I heard the explosion. Told I was on the phone with a friend. Said I have to go. Put the phone down. Closed up my briefcase. Put on my jacket. And proceeded to leave. Ran into one of my colleagues who was coming down the hall from the ladies' room. And she did. She said, I don't have my purse. I said, Forget it. We're gone. 五个大楼被撞击之后严重损毁。虽然客机撞正嘅西翼当时正进行翻新工程，并冇太多员工喺里面做嘢，但仍然造成大楼里面一百二十五人丧生，同埋机上全部嘅人都无一幸免。恐怖分子一共造成一百八十四人死亡。喺而家嘅五角大楼，经过收缉之后，已经睇唔到当时嘅损毁痕迹，但系创伤就仍然深印喺民众嘅脑海。美国总统奥巴马将会喺九一一十周年当日喺纪念园出席仪式，悼念死难者。香港天台记者韦家豪报道。